So I'm going to just make a bigger size scale of this one. This is going to be a wind turbine, vertical axis wind turbine. Plumbed up. Plumbed up right there. The top half of the turbine has been hoisted into place and secured to the axle. It's been a little bit there in the wind. I didn't quite complete it because I didn't want to have to hoist up a lot of extra weight. I can finish that later once I get this other bottom one up there. I'll have to raise this bottom one up to about the level of that 2x4 midway and then the blades will be attached to each one to hold them together and then I can finish that top part. The axle has been secured underneath there and on the top and I'll have to finish this framework too. We got the holes dug. I just got to hoist up the post and tie everything together yet. I just started hoisting up the bottom section and I'm just using a strap winch and a ratchet strap connected up the main beam up there and I have to go up to about right here so I got about four more feet to go.
Well, they just got the bottom end hoisted up. It's actually a little higher than what it needs to be. I need to drop it down to this line, but I'll put some blocking on the axle here to hold it first. And I have some planks laid out to hold the outer edge up. I guess it's not touching right now. I got it up a little too high. But then I can level this bottom one in all the way around and that's when I can build my blade supports and bracing in between here to hold it square and together and on here this is where the wheels are going to ride. I'm going to have three wheels uh, attached to these posts here and they'll ride on this uh, track all the way around. There'll be three of them so we got like a three-legged stool equal pressure. I'll have one over here and I'll just right on here. If those pieces would have been any bigger I think I probably would have had to build them in place. They're kind of hard for one guy to handle being that big. But anyway I got them up there a little bit of a struggle. Now I gotta finish the bracing on the structure and I think I probably might need a little additional bracing. We had some pretty good windstorms here and across the Dakotas the last couple of weeks. And I even had some damage on my wooden antenna on top of the barn I'm going to have to redo. And that will be another project for the future. But I'm going to continue on this now. i got to do the blades and i got to get those wheels secured on there to hold the whole thing up. So I'll see you next time.